Oklahoma running back Joe Mixon has been in the news over the last many years for different reasons. Some very, very bad, as we know. Some good, like recently uh, putting up great numbers at his pro, as a pro day. But I've said this. I think this is the most talented and athletic running back in the 2017 NFL draft. He was a five-star back in high school for many reasons. He's tall. He's big, he's fast, he's got great hands, he's just got superior athleticism, he can run inside, he can run outside. We saw all of that throughout high school. And the, the Rivals Camp Series in Los Angeles, I remember, was I think our second ever event. Uh, and, and Joe came out and he played running back, he played wide receiver, uh, he played a little bit of both, won our MVP, and cornerbacks couldn't cover this guy. Safeties couldn't come close. Linebacker certainly had no chance and he just showed amazing skill and speed. Uh, you know, and a guy that I thought could play wide receiver if he wanted to. He could grow into a tight end if he wanted to. He could be a tremendous running back. He could be a guy that you could put in wildcat packages for. I mean, just a freak athlete and a tremendous football player who obviously got into uh, you know some situations that have hurt his stock off the field. Uh, but I think someone's going to take him in the second round. Uh, I don't see him lasting past the second round. There might be a temptation for someone to take him in the late first round. That's how talented he is. Uh, the big issue is the PR spin. How do you justify taking him that high, and how do you justify him in your community and all that other good stuff? But the NFL, they don't really care about that. They care if he's going to score 10 touchdowns, and rush for a thousand yards or if he's going to do that against you. Um, so I think he's got a great future ahead of him if he could stay out of trouble off the field and we saw that great future in high school. Over the years I had seen former five-star Joe Mixon at least a dozen times in games, camps, seven-on-seven -seven tournaments, all kinds of settings and every single time he dominated on the field and was really just a special player uh, from his early years as a sophomore and then through his senior year when he really absolutely just took over and did whatever he wanted against high school competition. What I really liked about Mixon and what stood out to me was that he had all the physical attributes to be a special college and then NFL running back. Big power base, strong kid, really well developed and then he had that competitive edge uh, where he wanted to be the best player on the field every single time he took the field. So, uh, you know, I think from an on-the-field standpoint, as you look at this NFL draft, Mixon is right up there talent-wise and, and up there from a physical perspective with Leonard Fournette, Dalvin Cook, and Christian McCaffrey. Um, obviously, there are off-the-field issues that will need to be considered and addressed by NFL teams. Uh, but he's a kid who can run between the tackles, no problem. He's very difficult to tackle because he's so strong. Uh, I remember I saw him in an airport. I just happened to run into Mixon in an airport about a year ago. He shook my hand and almost broke every bone uh, in my hand because he's just a, a naturally strong kid. Uh, he runs hard with the ball in his hands. And then what will make him special in the NFL where running backs kind of have to be that dual threat uh, is he can catch the ball out of the backfield so well. Um, almost as well as Dalvin Cook. He's that kind of playmaker in the open field and then much tougher to bring down uh, than a lot of these running backs, I would say, other than Fournette. So Mixon has uh, the combination of everything you're going to need. NFL teams are going to have to feel comfortable drafting him with the off-the-field issues. But from a talent perspective, Mixon is right up there with the best running backs in an absolutely loaded class. Subscribe to the Rivals.com YouTube channel and get the very latest on college football and basketball recruiting, plus in-depth coverage of the Rivals Camp Series, various all-star games, exclusive archived footage, and much more.